Hello YouTubers, so here is your host from Gus Techno with a review of Evolution X Rome 3.3 with a release date of November 12, 2019. It is based on Android 10 and it's obviously for Poco F1 and apart from you know the standard Android 10 features uh, there are few good things uh, with this one I'll share the features of this room which are exclusive to this one apart from you know all the features which were explained in the pixel room for which I already shared a review I'll be posting the link below apart from that what sets this room apart is the customization so if you go to settings evolution settings status bar see you see status bar items you can highlight which icons you want to show up in the status bar you can change the 4g lte icon voltage icon brightness control uh, but i don't know how it works because we have a notch in the status bar then you also have network traffic as you can it's not visible right now because there's no activity going on notification light you can change then so under notification light what all features or for which apps you want it to be enabled you can do that force close notifications so whenever an application force closes you can show a dialog kill app button so if you want to you know uh, kill any app forcefully then you can just kill the app by long pressing the menu in the notifications and uh, vibrate on connect vibrate on call waiting vibrate on disconnect this feature i like because uh, it it's easy for me to you know know whenever the person has answered the call then you have quick settings the best option is disable quick settings when locked so this actually makes it more secure even if you have uh, encryption turned off i like this option then you have brightness slider light brightness slider on bottom so like i have i have put it at the bottom if you don't like it you can turn this one off then gestures you get standard android gestures with this one and you also get aosp gesture all right and uh, you get swipe to screenshot you get screen off power button torch so when i turn the screen off and i press the power button for some time it turns on the torch and automatically turns it off it you can also select never then you have status bar if i select double if i double tap the status bar the device will go to sleep mode and then you have lock screen double tap on the lock screen which is a standard feature and uh, then you have lock screen features such as pocket detection fingerprint authentication vibration lock screen shortcuts you can modify whichever apps you want status bar on the lock screen if you want the status bar to show up you can select that media artwork then you have music visualizer visualizer on the lock screen which i have enabled uh, right now and it works great you have navigation if you want uh, if you're using buttons you can change the button layout invert them then you have hardware buttons i have not selected volume ro rock awake at times it can you know initiate a unwanted wake up of the screen then you have playback control when the screen is off you can switch the tracks music tracks by pressing the volume keys and uh, hardware buttons okay we already did that now miscellaneous usb so by default which one you want to go to whether it, you want it for file transfer usb tethering you can select that wake up on charge i have enabled so that it makes it easier to you know uh, wake up the phone and also one of the great features of this one is you know i'll i'll tell you how to enable that and all of you who are you know uh, as i discussed earlier that miui 11 it uh, it has a global dark mode for poco f1 well that's good but 
In this one, we can get that global dock mode through the developer settings. Alright, so what you have to do is go to developer settings, scroll down, scroll down. Now you will see an option to override force dark. You see, so when I I have selected this and now I'll show you in play music. I have dark mode. Alright, so dark mode it works really great on this one and I'm actually preferring this one for now because uh, I don't know I like the pixel features which are here and you also have uh, you know uh, the wallpapers uh, Pokemon is there so if I select this one right and I set it as wallpaper you see here it is we get all the nice features of the pixel room and lots of customizations with a great battery backup so if you like it please subscribe i'll be posting the links below of the firmware and the rom you can flash both all you need to do is clean wipe vrt wrp flash the firmware then the rom you should be good to go it also supports encryption so if you want that you can uh, select the encryption option else you can flash the dfe once the room is flashed all right thank you